Okay. Ice cold water. Amazing. And the... good morning, by the way. Oh, yeah. Welcome uh, to today's vlog. We have valet here in Sydney. But um, let us just tell you how expensive it is. We are paying $69 a day. <laughs> if you're gonna go park your car in a parking house, it's gonna cost you $50 at least yeah. anyways. Okay, let's go. Did you know that it's the biggest steel bridge in the world? It looks like uh, the Eiffel Tower. Just bridge edition. Yeah. It's 1,140 meters, 49 meters long. How tall is it? Tall. Today we have our first full day in Sydney. And since we have a car, and since Sydney is the biggest uh, city in the world based on area, we are taking the car to drive around Sydney to like get a good idea about what this city is. Now we're driving to Manly Beach to get some uh, lunch and um, enjoy some uh, view because it's located right next to the ocean. Oh my god, it's expensive. 16, 15, $15 for one hour and 25 minutes. What? I think it's gonna be one of the biggest expenses on this trip, parking in Sydney. The, the pantry, the pantry Manly. This is one of the best uh, restaurants to get lunch, according to TripAdvisor. So far, I really like this place. Like a view couldn't be better. No. I'm, I'm just so tired now. Australians really know how to make burgers in general. Should we uh, take a walk down here? We have 30 minutes before we uh, have to be back by the car. Let's uh, go say hi to Brad Pitt. Yeah. Let's see if we can find the harbor. I think that's a harbor on the other side. I don't think this is a real harbor. It's not, but it's still charming. It still has that harbor vibe. We really have to hurry back to the car, actually. That's manly. Pretty manly experience. Not the place you go to explore culture and anything out of the extraordinary. Definitely a good place to uh, hang out if you like going to the beach. Amelia probably wouldn't mind staying there for a few months simplicity funerals they offered prepaid funerals does that mean that you pay for your funeral and everything before you're dead i'm pretty sure that's what it means that's so morbid we are now going to the area an area called belmain balmain 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 well, i don't know how to pronounce it but it's a hipster slash rich kid area and we're gonna check it out to see if we can fit in <laughs> sorry for ruining the footage <laughs> dick's hotel dick's hotel yeah good news we can park two hours for free. What are we gonna spend our money on now that uh, parking is free? Sydney is huge. Oh, my dream car, Amelia. You just hear it, right? The 100,000 subscriber car. One thing in Australia that I will never like, they can copy everything. There's so many replicas of very high-end designer furniture. As a Dane, my heart bleeds when I see a replica of this chair because I'm too proud. When are we getting a, a house, Amelia? So we can buy furniture. When we reach 500 subscribers. 500? Maybe. Or a million. A million? 500,000. <laughs> so we're never getting a house. No, never. <laughs> I'm drinking a million. <laughs> oh, why didn't you get a surprise? Very charming. It is very Melbourne in this area right here. If we hadn't already have had lunch, had, have if we had. Had, hadn't had... 
if we all if, if we didn't already we have had lunch, lunch this would be a nice place to eat lunch because it's so cozy i are, are really you, like this place here's, a, here's another one everywhere What's happening with this weather, Amelia? It's not very Sydney. I thought it would be very good weather here in Sydney. We are now in Darlings Point, which isn't the area that we were supposed to go, but Jon, he wants to be surrounded by rich people. Fuck off, so Amelia. we ended up going to the Why most expensive area Amelia. in the, in Sydney. Amelia, I had I had no idea that da Darling Point, which is the most expensive area of Sydney, I have no idea that we we, we are here because we have no idea what we are doing. Actually, <sighs> we talked about something uh, on our way to this place. We did not plan at all, and uh, what we talked about was that it is kind of difficult to visit a big city because you don't know where to start like there's so much to do that you just get paralyzed in terms of actually doing anything does that make sense that's the uh, darling point taxi harbor are you sure yep i got it hello are you are you catching anything no where's uh, where's the opera Oh yeah. Well, good luck fishing. If you had to compare Sydney with Melbourne, what is in favor of Sydney and what is in favor of Melbourne? The beauty is in favor of Sydney. It's way prettier. Yeah. You got this very hilly landscape and there's so many nice viewpoints here where you can actually see the entire city. And you just got the channel. You, yeah, exactly. I like the edgy personality that Melbourne has compared to Sydney. That is a pretty house. Oh my god, look at that garden they got. <laughs> that is a beautiful oh house. Oh my god, it's incredible that house. That it's like a fortress. Yeah. Jesus Christ. Can you even capture it, Amelia? I don't know. Maybe you should zoom out. Like, all, like everybody thinks we're just thieves who are mm. scouting houses. I'm sure <laughs> we look a bit suspicious. Look at this house, I love it. Beautiful. Um, and the view. Incredible fucking I view. Mean, that's a pretty fast police car. Even the police cars are expensive here. How long have we been in the car now? Half an hour and we've moved 300 meters. That's still 1.8 kilometers, so we'll probably be home when it's dark. This is what we are paying for. Drop the fucking car in the middle of the most busy street in the town. Only took one hour to drive here uh, from two kilometers away. Oh sweet. Oh, oh. This bit is so fucking good. Right now I don't care about the minibar has a price tag. My baby is going to the hospital again. Booba 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 It was Dick Cheney and Bush. <laughs> it needs an inspection at the Remover Hospital. They couldn't fix it. They're closing in half an hour. Uh oh. Quick look. You always say that, it's never quick. My boys and girls. We didn't go to Gucci. Uh, we went. We we we. 
We went like by like randomly stumbled upon the bridling uh, watch randomly watch shop and uh, that's where I had my uh, bridling stolen. It wasn't where you had your. No, I didn't. Stolen. The bridling didn't steal my <laughs> they bridling. Offered, they offered uh, you champagne, as you can probably hear. I'm looking to get a new bridling because I feel like somebody chopped my arm off, and now I can't play the banjo of life. <laughs> banjo. <laughs> The banjo. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but well, I'm. We, I have to anyway, sleep on it now, yeah. and and it's all. It's been a long day too. Let us know what you think about this video. Let us know. Comment below and like that puppy. And we see you in our next Sydney video.